So it seems Foster Chase's rights issue is finally a go. Mayberry would have posted uh, this to their Instagram page, letting investors know that they are currently accepting applications from existing ordinary shareholders for the rights issue. So whatever drama was going on with SSL that would have been preventing Fosterage from going ahead with its rights issue, it seems that that issue has now been resolved. Now you might be wondering what a rights issue is and how you can make money from a rights issue. So we'll be discussing those things in this video. So first, what is a rights issue? So I believe this Investopedia graphic uh, captures it perfectly. So basically, a rights issue is an offer to existing shareholders to purchase newly issued stock, the right to which they can usually exercise or sell on the open market. So typically with a rights issue, shareholders that already own stock within the company will get the chance from the company to buy more stock within said company. Now usually these shareholders can either exercise that right and buy more shares as well as they can choose to forego the right where other shareholders will get the chance to take up that offer to purchase those shares basically. So the rights issue basically gives all shareholders an equal chance to acquire more shares within the company they're already invested in. So the question you may have now is how can you make money from a rights issue? Well, typically when rights issues are done, the newly issued shares that are made available to the existing shareholders are often offered at a discounted price. So if the market price for the shares are $5, usually the company will offer a discount on that price, maybe for example $4.90 per share, which would incentivize existing shareholders to participate in the rights issue. Additionally, with additional shares being now listed on the market, this can also increase trading volumes on the shares. So more investors may decide to start buying and selling the shares, which can also lead to an increase in the share price if there is an excess demand, but the supply still cannot meet that demand. So that's another way you can make money from a rights issue as well as similar to stock splits rights issues may lead to increased publicity on a stock so more people might be looking into that stock as an investment so you can find that more investors might be looking to buy that stock continue to follow the jamaican investor for more investment tips tricks news and information to help you level up your investment game and get to financial freedom and feel free to check out mayberry's site for information on this rights issue